Happy Easter, everyone. We are so excited. Today's Easter Sunday. We put on our best Easter dresses so we can celebrate the good news today. I am Mary Rod Copeland. And I'm Kenny Copeland. And we want to share a story with you today. First, let's start with a prayer. Happy Easter, God. Christ is risen. We thank you for the gift of life and love that you give to us each and every day, and especially in the raising of your son, Jesus Christ, from the dead. Because of Jesus, we now live in him and he in us, and we know that you are with us always. Thank you, thank you, O oh almighty and loving God. Amen. Our story today comes from the book of Matthew. Three sad days pass by. Jesus is dead. Three days ago, they buried him in the tomb. Jesus' two friends, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary, are going to visit the tomb. They think about Jesus all the time, and now they want to pay their respects to him. It has been just three days since he died. When they get there, the ground under them starts to shake. An earthquake. The women close their eyes, afraid. No, an angel of God is making the earth move. Mary and Mary open their eyes and see the angel coming down from heaven. The angel stops at the big stone that covers the tomb and then rolls it away from the opening. Then he jumps up lightly and sits on top of the stone. Mary and Mary stare at the angel. Yes, it is an angel. He looks like lightning. His clothes are as white as snow. No, whiter whiter than any white on earth. The men who are guarding the tomb see the angel. His appearance is so frightening to them that they shake and tremble, then cower in a corner, not moving. They are like dead men, so they are still. But the angel turns to Mary and Mary. He has some news for them. He says, do not be afraid. I know you're looking for Jesus who was crucified. Mary and Mary nod their heads. Yes, that's why they're here. The angel says, he is not here and he is not dead. He has been raised from death back to life. He is alive. Remember that he promised you that he would be raised up. Mary and Mary stand there like statues. Where is he then? Isn't he in the tomb? The angel says to them gently, look, Come see the place where he was laid in the tomb. Look, it's empty. He's not there. The women peek into the tomb. Even though it is dark in there, they can see. Yes, it's empty. Jesus is gone. The angel says to them, you are the first to find out. Now go and find Jesus' disciples. When you see them, say to them, Jesus has been raised from the dead and he is on his way to Galilee right now. So go to Galilee and you will see him there. Mary and Mary leave the tomb. They are both very afraid and very happy at the same time. They run back to find the disciples. But before they find them, suddenly Jesus shows up in front of them. He says to them, greetings. Is that really Jesus? Jesus who was dead? Yes, it is him. Mary and Mary fall down at his feet and worship him. They are still afraid. Jesus says to them, don't be afraid. Go tell the men, my brothers and my disciples, go to Galilee and they will see me there. Jesus wants to meet the disciples on the mountain that is Galilee. So the 11 disciples without Judas go up the mountain. They see Jesus. They fall on their knees and worship him when they see him. Jesus says to them, now that you see me, I give you work to do go and tell everybody the good news so that they can be disciples too and then you can baptize them in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit and then teach them what i have taught you the disciples nod they can do this jesus was dead and is now alive through jesus they can do anything then jesus said to them So Jenny and I made some crafts and the directions for how to make this will be in your email. 
um, but you can make an empty tomb. Jenny, do you want to show them what we made? So, this is um, the tomb that we made. So, this is the stone that the angel sat on and rolled away. And it says, he is not there. He has been raised from the dead. An empty tomb. Cool. All right, and we made one more thing. Well, I really made special it. for Easter. Jenny made it. But, you show us? Um, it says, Happy Easter. It's like Jesus on um, the grass. And it says, He is risen. We're going to send this card to somebody that we love so we can share the good news about Jesus' rising from the dead on this Happy Easter Sunday. We hope that you and your families have a very, very happy Easter. And see if you can find a way. Share with us. We'd love to hear how you're going to celebrate the good news today. We'd like to close with a prayer. Let's all bow our heads, praying hands. Heavenly Father, we thank you for, your, for sending your Son, Jesus Christ, to be with us always. Send us back to our families with your love and guide us this week so we can always follow Jesus in whatever we do. This week, this we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Bye, everybody. Bye. Happy Easter.